I'd like to know what broke you open. <laughs> oh, Lord. Um, you know, it's so funny because I was, when I was talking to God this morning, praying about um, everything that we was going to talk about, we was going to share. And I was like, oh, well, I might as well. And then when you said it just now, I said, okay, okay, I'll talk about it. But um, for a long time, I, because I want to protect my parents, because I want to protect my family, I even got into the habit of trying to protect God because I felt like, and Christians as a whole, because I just felt like people... People don't see like real Christians. And even if I like to have fun and I like to be a free spirit, like I am serious about the way that I love God, like and how hard I go for him. And I wanted people to know, like, no, like there are actually real like people who are living a certain lifestyle, you know, to please God. Like it is possible. But it got to the point where I don't know. I guess I tried to be <laughs> God that, you know, it, it just wasn't even, it wasn't even healthy. Um, and I wasn't allowing anybody to come in and people didn't know that I had been going through a lot of my own personal things for a really long time because it wasn't that I was putting on or that I was faking or any of that. It was just, I've always wanted to be happy within myself, you know, even in really bad situations. Like I have story after story after story as far as um, them telling me to abort my child, as far as having miscarriages and late term miscarriages, as far as being molested and I have I have story after story after story but people would never know because I I decided when I was young that I would never be a victim